How's it going, students? I'm T-Pop, and I want to take a moment just to show you what to expect for Schoology and how to get started on kind of the day-to-day -day here in this course. If you're logged into Schoology, you're off to a great start. Let's go ahead and go through the things that we need to do kind of each day and how to prepare. The first thing you're going to see is a link for breakfast and lunch. If you're eating lunch or breakfast here at Centennial, you're going to want, you're going to, want to fill out this link each day. The next thing is the classroom. This is how you'll log into the Google Meet to join the classroom. If you're in person, you don't need to worry about this link, but if you're part of the group that's at home or distance learning, you're going to need to log into this every day. By clicking on it, it will automatically open the Google Meet class. This is the opportunity you opportunity you're going to want to take to mute your microphone and if you want you can also mute your camera over here it says join now if yours says ask to join you're going to need to switch your account in the upper right hand corner make sure you're logged into your centennial google account when you come in here this is where you're going to want to watch and participate if you have any questions related to the class content you can click on the chat box and i'll post a link where you can ask those some questions i'll try to get those get to those questions in a timely manner but my goal is to answer them at the end of the class for the last 15 minutes feel free to come back to this google meet at any time to ask those questions Questions, you might just want to leave this tab open during the class. All right, if you have any other questions that are a little bit more personal or things that you want me to answer just to you that's not core content related, you can send me a message using the Messenger app in Schoology. And again, I'll try to get to those in a timely manner. These ones I'm not going to be able to get to very quickly. Next is the daily attendance. The daily attendance is a form that you'll fill out every single day to mark that you're here. In order to fill out this attendance, there's a few questions you'll need to be asked, including what hour you are, your last name, your first name, all the question of the day, and a password. To get the password, you have to join the class, and I'll give you that password. All right, the next thing is the weekly pacing guide. This is an extremely important document that lets you know what to do next or what to do each day. So if you're lost and you don't know what to do next, check this document and it will let you know. For today, you, you, there's a greeting from the teacher. That's the Google Meet, the breakfast and lunch selection. But notice here, the very first item, it says, the checklist item says, watch welcome announcement video. Hey, you're off to a great start. That's the first thing that you can check off that's needs that needs needed to be done. The rest of these check boxes are things that you'll find on Schoology that are items that need to be complete. So let me show you where those are found. If you look at the unit one folder and expand it, it'll say science week one and this, this week's date range. This is where you're gonna wanna jump. You can also access this information by going to the course calendar. Notice here's the week, this week for week one for group A, or for the first set of students. So I'm gonna go ahead and click that and view the item. This is gonna take you to the week's worth of material. Now you're only gonna see up to the material of the day that we're working on it. So for example, there's only five things here. These are the things that need to get done today. There are more items, they're just hidden from you for now and I'll open those up tomorrow or on the day that they need to get done. So as I, if I look down, here are the list of items that need to get done today that match the list of things in our weekly pacing guide. So the next thing is a tutorial, course expectations and syllabus. Notice that that's the first thing in our week folder. Now I'm gonna click on that and get started, which is what I want you to do right now. As you complete these items, there are completion rules down here that let you know that they need to get done. So this one, I need to take it and I need to score at least a one, which is the full points for that assignment in order to know that I'm done with that. The next item, I need to make a submission and so on and so forth. If you complete all these things for today, you're off to a great start, you're golden, and you'll be ready for tomorrow when more things are added. Make sure you have your science notebook. If you have any questions, feel free to jump on the Google Meet, post those questions on there, and I'll try to answer those at the end of class. All right, good luck, students. Go ahead and get started.